Good morning, you guys. So today's video is going to be a get it all done with me today. I kind of take you guys along my daily to-do list. That's kind of how I see these videos is I tackle everything on my to-do list. You guys get to watch, you guys get to be motivated. Hopefully motivate and inspire you guys to tackle your to-do list as well. I just wanted to say that not every day is like this. Sometimes I have more to do, sometimes I have less to do. Regardless, you guys are getting a realistic get it all done video from me today. So first I am going to get every Everything out because we are having chili tonight. It's almost 10 o'clock, but I wanted to go ahead and get it in the crock pot and just let it simmer and put it on low for the whole day. Go ahead and start tackling my other things for today, and I already have dinner in the crock pot. I need some ground turkey. Oh, here it is right here. We're gonna do ground turkey instead of beef. And then we need tomato sauce, pinto beans, kidney beans, diced tomatoes, and then also chili mix but I can't find it because there's like a million other mixes in here. Never mind, I found them. Frank put the groceries away and he put them right there. Mind you, this is like all the baking and like nut related stuff. Packets are right there, but that was the spot that was chosen. <laughs> and then we gotta grab, oh, wrong place, the crock pot. Frank just got done hanging up these pictures that we got from Fracture. These are actually made out of glass and the quality is amazing. I absolutely love it so much. It's actually from a wall plan that I did through their website. You guys can probably hear Fletcher behind me where I put all the pictures in and I was able to see what it would look like. Here's this picture of us and then we have one of all of the kids. This one is probably my favorite of us all walking together. Everybody is smiling. And then I included a picture of just Frank and I, and then I had to include a silly one as well. Just to show that family pictures aren't always, per just to show that family pictures are always perfect. We and kids don't always want it, and they and the kids don't always want to cooperate. This is just this is just reality of having a lot of kids, and you can't get them all to smile. So I had to include that one to go with all the rest of the pictures. If you guys want something that will transform your favorite photos into beautiful, glowing glass prints of the highest quality, shipped right to your door with everything you need to easily hang on your wall or stand on top of a table definitely check out Fracture. They turn your photos into simple, frameless works of art. We actually just got our family pictures done recently, and these were hands down my favorite ones that we have taken so far. So I definitely wanted to display them somewhere in the house. But I love how simple and durable these are, but also elegant at the same time. Fracture is also proud to be carbon neutral. Their team is always on the lookout for innovative ways to protect our planet from the impact of waste and disposable plastics. So from class to production to packaging, they are committed to a small footprint. Like I was telling you guys before, I was able to go right onto their website, upload the pictures that I wanted to display on our walls, and then I was actually able to see what it looks like from the website as well. I also wanted to let you guys know that I got the matte finish for all of my pictures, but they also have a glossy original finish too that you guys can pick from. If you guys would like to order your own Fracture photo wall or glass print, you guys can use my code Brittany22 and that will give you guys 22% off of your order. I'll link everything below. Again, that link is Brittany22. So before I can get started though, I just realized that I have not unloaded the dishwasher yet, so I'm going to do that. That way I can go ahead and wash the dishes, have like a clean workspace, go ahead and load everything back in there, and then I'll kind of clean up as I go. How'd you do? I'm not broken, I'm just split in two Hope you're fine, ain't got time To do everything you said you would Frames of the past and The memory of you just come running by Pictures of sunny days With your smile in the bar Are you helping mommy? Who has a criminal past? Are you helping mommy? It looks like he's carrying around a minstrel cup. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Oh, he heard his baba. He heard the. Doo -doo -doo. Look at that, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> It's the same. <laughs> well, Did you just go on camera? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. How could they say I was 
broken How could they say you made me come undone Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them How could they say I was broken How could they say you made me come undone Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them To be cool, even wear that shirt you wanted to My friends think I'm lame, since I met you I am not the same It was not meant to be a fake This is the easy, this recipe, I feel like I've shared this ah! I've shared this recipe so many times But it's, it's one of our, it's a staple, it's so easy to make so good. You can add some minced garlic or onions to this, but usually what I do is I'll brown my turkey first and sometimes I'll add the packet with the meat and mix it all together and then add it to the crock pot. But you can obviously add the meat, then the packets, and then everything else. Whatever you want to do. And then I always get questions about the lining in my crock pot and what it, what is it? Is it safe? I mean, I think it is. I've used these for the longest time. The brand is Reynolds. It's slow cook. I can't talk today. Slow cooker liners. I think you can get different sizes. I don't know. This is just the regular size. It says it fits three to eight quarts. Fast and easy cleanup. It is BPA free, so I do want to say that. Because a lot of people are always worried about cooking it with plastic. Because I've seen some comments about it not being safe or it's harmful to cook with plastic. I don't know. So it just looks like this. Nice. Wrap it around the sides. Put the food in here. And then when we're done with dinner, I can just take it out and throw it away. Sometimes there will be like some nasty stuff that will leak on through in here. And I can just like take a damp and just wipe it out. Happy end. Girl, you take care now. I hope we can be friends. How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay. Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them. How could they say I was broken? While it's cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and get the dog's food ready because they have not had breakfast yet. So what I usually do is we have the Ollie subscription. So we get all of their food. It's like a fresh food. It has like all different kind of veggies, meats and stuff. I think this, I mix chicken with lamb and then I just take their regular food and mix it all together. Never up, never down, never Like a theme in a song, clever Feeling high, feeling low at the same time Feels so right, then I'm wrong, hoping I'll be fine But I get up, I always do I never think, I always do Never thought I wouldn't jump, oh what a fool to include this as well in this get it all done video because Frank has been working on some new and exciting things this coming year for Simply Edged. We are in the work with some new product items and we've kind of taken a break for the month of January but we're ready to get started and working on some new things so you guys make sure you guys are following our Simply Edged Instagram when we launch these new products. 
I currently have you guys propped up on my laundry basket because I am too lazy to go downstairs and grab my tripod. But I broke my number one rule and that is putting on a load of laundry before doing anything because then you're killing two birds with one stone. You're washing your clothes and then getting other stuff done. I did not do that and I have all of the kids' clothes to do. Actually, the girls, when I say girls, I mean Scarlett and Harlow's clothes and Fletcher's in the dryer. So I'm actually going to fluff that up for the second or third time and then I'll put that away today and then get this started. And then I have Nolan and Aria's laundry to do. So I'm gonna throw in a couple laundry pods, fabric softener, and I could probably make it easier on myself and sit here for the next 30 minutes and undo the clothes the right way. So when I fold them, I don't have to do it. But honestly, I don't wanna do that right now either, so. to get it right trying to find some balance in my life i never really put up a fight and now i'm losing sleep what if i lost touch what if i'll never get it right So I am actually getting ready to do a little living room makeover and a DIY project with you guys very soon. I'm changing a few things around in the living room and one of the things that I'm getting now that Christmas is kind of behind us. I want to get some new pillow covers. I'm going with a different theme. You guys will see. I will do a video all about it. Um, but I wanted to take all of these pillow covers. That's a great thing about switching to pillow covers now is I can take them off and wash them and change them however many times I want to. Also, I never thought that I would see the day that I would be vacuuming my couch. I have never done this before until I met Frank and I saw him doing it one day. I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> I like posted it on Instagram and you guys were like, um, Brittany, we vacuum our couch too and it is genius I don't know why I haven't done that before because it's just so much easier to clean and vacuum all the crumbs than trying to wipe them off so um, anyways if you haven't vacuumed your couch yet it's, it's a little life-changing it will definitely make cleaning a little bit more easier all right guys so I actually have to go pick up the kids in 30 minutes let me see if I can set you guys right there. 30 minutes and I am going to quickly clean our half bath because this is the bathroom that most, or I say most of the kids, all of the kids use this bathroom, we all do, um, but this is the one that probably, maybe besides the kids bathroom, gets the messiest because we're constantly using it. It's on the bottom level. It's easier for the kids, you know, because they're mainly downstairs. So I'm going to clean it. Actually, let me go grab my bucket of products. I just have to clean the sink, clean the toilet, wipe everything down. I'm actually probably going to disinfect this door because I see like handprints and all kind of stuff on here. But I'm gonna go ahead and get started since I have to go. I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time being so serious idiots thinking it will matter keep me company downtown before the clock runs out sun is shining but the rain is welcome too friends are nearby don't need another feel time is not on my mind but then it's you oh i love it when the love comes around and then i remember all things must pass but i'm not gonna wake up wake up i'm not ready let me have another day don't wake up Cause I'm happy, I'm not gonna wake up No, no, not yet, whoa No, not yet, whoa No, no, not yet, whoa I'm afraid I'll end up nowhere They keep saying I'll be fine But how you know that I'll be there When it feels like I'm lying every time Someone ask how it goes Welcome to 
you Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind, but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around And then I remember All things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up Keep it steady, cause I'm happy I'm not gonna wake up No, no, no hours since I last filmed. I think the last thing I did was clean the bathroom. I went to go get the kids, got them all settled in, and then I've just been kind of relaxing and getting back to emails. It is now five o'clock, so it's getting around dinner time. I wanted to just start this a little bit earlier, but I got distracted with my emails and work, so I'm gonna start it now, but I'm making some homemade cornbread. I got my oven preheating at 425. I'll leave all the exact measurements for the ingredients down below. But you're gonna need sugar, all-purpose flour, cornmeal, I'm just using plain enriched yellow cornmeal, and some, oh, some baking powder, salt, oil, and then I forgot the eggs, two eggs, and a cup of milk. All right, so I got a question. 16 by 16. Yeah, I know that. But what I was gonna say was, I'm getting ready to go out here and measure how much salt here. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. Wait a minute. Is this the last bit of milk? No. Brittany. We did get our milk and bread though yesterday. <laughs> you got milk and bread. Listen, you got, I was like, You okay. got two gallons of milk. Well, because Fletcher. Fletcher drinks milk. Yes. He, he'll drink that's a gallon what I'm of saying. milk I think that's like why people days. get milk because if kids cereal, people can eat cereal and you can do a lot with milk. So, anyways. <laughs> But no, okay. I'm gonna go measure for a bouncy house. <laughs> I was just kidding. Well, I, I mainly wanted the bread to make grilled cheese sandwiches. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and mix everything together. I'm gonna use my skillet. Let me get that out really quick. I'll show you guys a little trick that my grandma actually taught me about making cornbread because she used to make homemade cornbread all the time. I was yours for the taking. Guess I needed a home But if I'm not mistaken You were good on your own oh, And I know, I know I was drunk enough Didn't know, didn't know it would mess me up, yeah Now I'm truly awakened, oh Say you wanna talk again But it's time I do this my way I don't wanna be your friend Think we hit our expiration date I want you to feel the way taught me was to put some oil in the pan enough to cover the bottom and then put this in the oven when it's already preheated for about five to ten minutes let it get nice and hot so when you put your cornbread in here it will get crispy around the edges and it won't stick to into the oven we go yeah. you're the one you're the one to be honest yeah because you can handle emotions oh. For 25 minutes. 25 minutes, that's a long time. That's a long time. You don't get to call me up. Tell me that you need forgiveness. You're the one who called it off. Broke my heart in just a minute. No, you don't get to call it love. When it was in me. So we're plating up our food 
here's how the chili turned out. Turned out perfectly. I got our toppings. We got some shredded cheese, avocado. I'm gonna put some sour cream on mine. And then we like to put Fritos, corn chips, all over it as well. Or you could use the scoop ones. They didn't have the scoop ones. And scoop with your chili, that's also good too. guys so that is going to wrap it up for this get it all done video you guys can get a little bit of an insight on what a typical day is like for me and trying to tackle all of my to-do lists I hope that it will give you guys some motivation and inspire you guys to also tackle your to-do list because I know sometimes we got a long list of things to do and we do not have to tackle them alone we are all in this together all in this okay anyways um i just wanted to also remind you guys but check out fracture again i will leave all the information the link everything down below and you guys can also use my code britney 22 to get 22 percent off of your order so thank you guys so much for watching we love you guys and we will see you in our next video bye guys mm -hmm.